We're in the fish trap section here. Saw blade. Oh boy! What's up, Raw fam? So if you've been watching my videos lately, you would know I actually had to take down my massive 3,000 gallon pond. The pond is actually right here. This thing is so beautiful. But before we could set this pond up, we have to make sure that we are caught up with the fish feedings. But guys, I have fish literally this big because when I get all of my fish back, they're definitely gonna be like really, really hungry. They're gonna be like rah, 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 rah. So of course we have to get out of here, go to Walmart, get a fish trap and a bait cage for all of my beautiful fish. So what are we doing here? Let's get out of here and go do that. All right, Raw fam, so we're over here at Walmart and as you guys can see, we're in the fish trap section here. And uh, as you can see, this is like a little plastic bin. We're just gonna, oh my gosh. So we have this little beautiful little fish trap. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> So as you guys can see, we have our little fish trap right here. Now, all we have to do is cut a little hole right here, put some bait in it, and we will catch some food for all of my beautiful little fishies back at the Raw Fam. So of course, let's get out of here and go build it. All right, Raw Fam, so as you guys can see, we have our fish trap now. We have our Dremel, it's right This thing is so powerful and it has like a little saw blade right there. How cool is that? Now we have this little fish trap right here and all we really have to do, we're gonna take this little Dremel right here and we're going to cut a hole right here. You know, that should be perfect. So look, ready, ready, ready? So of course, now we have our hole drilled. You guys ready? Come, 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 come. Ready, three, two, one. Oh wait, <laughs> it didn't go. It's punch, it, punch it hard, hard, hard. <laughs> Ow! Oh, let me see if I can just rip this bad boy out. Uh, uh, so as you guys can see, this is the little panel to our trap. We don't need that, but if you look right here, this is now officially our little hole. So all of our little fishies could go inside the trap. So of course, as you guys can see, this is our beautiful little fish trap. Now we have a little hole right here. We're gonna just take some average koi food, put it right in here, and of course, all these beautiful little fishies are gonna go, Who's cooking that good stuff? Dang! And of course, they're gonna smell it. They're gonna say, you know, my grandma is inside of here. They're gonna swim right in. They're gonna eat the koi food. And of course, they're gonna get captured and most likely eaten by my massive red tails. So of course, Ralph fam, what are we doing here? I think grandma's cooking up some good stuff over at my fishing spot, so let's get out of here. All right, Ralph fam, so as you guys can see, we're over here and we have our fish trap and we also have our little bit of koi food. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take this right here. Come here, come here, come here. So we have our little koi food now, guys, Ralph fam. Now I'm gonna include you guys in on like a little secret. So this right here, this is like a little popcorn can, but inside, Oh yeah, so we have three different types of koi food. This is also another secret I've also added. So look, this right here is a 50-50 mixture of Tetra Flakes and Aquascape Koi Pellets. This right here alone is absolutely perfect, but what you have to realize is everything inside of this is also floating. But here, all right here, there's shiners deep down below. So whenever I come here, I make sure I bring sinking cichlid gold. Now trust me guys, it's really good. So first, what I'll do, I'll take my little hand, look right here, I'll just take some of that. That's all you really need, because you want them to be you know, nice and happy and eating all of the koi pellets, you don't want them to be full. So what we're gonna do, we're just gonna take the top of this little pan and put it right there. And then we're gonna grab some from in here. We gotta make sure it's a good mixture. So as you guys can see, this is our beautiful little mixture right here. We're gonna open up our little fish trap and we're just gonna dump this right in, you ready? Oh yeah, so of course inside of there is some sinking pellets, there's also some floating pellets and there's also some like mid column um, tetra flakes that are just gonna go everywhere. So technically, this little koi blend of koi food in here is literally going to cover everything. So of course when your trap is set, what we're gonna do is take this lid, put it back, okay, and now every time before you set a trap, you're gonna make sure that you also have your chum ready to go. So we're gonna take some of this, the same amount, we're just gonna pour a little bit of that inside my hand. Now I'm gonna squeeze my hand just like that, it's all there. All right guys, you ready? Three, two, see it all? See it all right there? Look, 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 look. Hurry, 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 hurry. So what you have to do is take, see the koi food's almost here. We're gonna take, put some water in here. Okay. 
take all this out of there. Okay, so all of that current is coming this way, and this trap is just gonna sit right there. Have, look, 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 the koi food's already here. Look at all the minnows on top. See all the fish eating it? Please tell me, you want me to see? You want me to get it? Yeah, I can see it from here. You can see it perfectly? Oh yeah. my God, look, there's a big gar. Actually, I think we should just leave it. All right, hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, so look, so this is what I was talking about. There's a bunch of current over here and it's just gonna push all this food all the way over this way. And now, when they all see all this food, they're gonna have a big chum slick, and it's gonna go right into this little trap. All right guys, so there's already fish inside of this trap. Okay, you guys also have to be looking. You have to use your eyesight so you don't spook something. Oh my God, back up, back up, back up. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. What'd you see, what'd you see? I think it was either a massive snakehead, a bowfin, uh, maybe, a, a gar, I just call it like the back of its tail. So what we're going for right now is we're going for green tilapia, blue tilapia, you know, anything in here that, you know, is a bait fish, and that right there, if that goes down our little slick all the way over to that bucket over there, uh, it will literally swim right into the trap and eat all the food that's in there. Now, that's a good thing, and it's also a very, very bad thing because, you know, if he eats all the baits, then obviously all of our baits are gone. But if he doesn't, then we get a two for one bonus and we get a cool pet to put inside the pond. So you ready? Hey, look, 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 look. You guys see all the mollies right there? There's a thousand mollies all right there. Oh my goodness, guys. So we're just gonna keep backing it up. Dave, back up, bro. Hold the, hold the camera. And uh, oh, you wanna go check the trap? So let's do that. So we're gonna make our way over to this trap. Come on. Oh, don't walk over there just yet. There's still thousands and thousands of little baits on top of the water. Let's just sit down right here and sit. All right, Raw fam, so we've literally baited this whole area. There's like a, there's like a 25 yard area that we're fishing right now. If we don't get anything, we'll just move 25 yards down the canal right now. But I think we're doing pretty good. So we're just gonna give it five, 10 minutes and then obviously make our way over to that trap right now. Raw fam, trust me, you guys have to let your trap sit. You don't wanna let it sit too long because then all of the bait obviously inside the trap gets eaten. I think there's, oh my God, there's a massive, Dave, Dave, back up, back up, back up. Do you, do you see him? Yeah. There's a massive school right there. As you guys can see, I, I don't know if you could see into the water, but you see all that rippling. That is hundreds, and, and there's more koi food right there. There's literally more koi food right there. It's all drifting in, like I said. There's hundreds, oh my goodness. Those are all mollies right there. So of course, Rolf, and we're gonna give it like five more minutes. Honestly, guys, I need to hurry up and go check that trap because I think it's gonna be absolutely loaded. So, <laughs> let's do that. <sighs> All right, Raw fam, so as you guys can see, we got our bucket now. Of course, it's, you know, it's time to check the trap, come on. Here, fishy, fishy, fishies, come on, fishies. Oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna have to just run over to it. There's a billion little mollies and minnows and all that cool stuff right outside the trap. Oh, a shiner! Bro, a shiner was right there! Oh my, did you, did you see that? Ah, uh, jeez, he was literally like that big. Okay, hold up. All right, I have this. I don't really need the bucket. We'll just set everything right here. Jeez. Okay. Here, babies. I'm here, babies. I'm here. I'm here. Nope, nope, stay in the trap. I gotta need your guys' help. Maybe I could do this. I could just grab one handle. You wanna grab one handle? Yeah, we're kind of good place in my foot. Oh, it's very heavy. Yeah. Let me see the camera. Go for it. Oh my gosh! What? What? David, 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 David. Oh my gosh! There's Jags! There's jags. Okay, so raw fam, sorry. There's like a really rare species of fish over here. The only person I actually know off the top of my brain that has one as a pet is catch them all fishing. But, bro, there's like 50 of them. Come here, come here, come here. You see them all? You see them all? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, there's a cichlid. There's some jags. Oh, David. David, yes! Okay, David, you gotta film, buddy. So, you guys obviously know that we made this trap today in order to stock like a live well for all of my fish. When they get back from all these different places, 
They're gonna be hungry. Rolf him. are you guys ready for the most insane trap? Guys, I'm telling you, it's already the most insane trap I've ever made. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh my gosh! There's so many. See all the koi pills that are still in here? Let's get some water. Look at them, there are, there's so many that they're just flopping in. Okay, so those are all, look at this. Look at this. Dude, that's a beast. This is a perfect red tail bait, look at that. Guys, this is like the perfect bait right here. My red tail is going to absolutely annihilate this thing head first. It's gonna go like this and go, ah. Oh. <laughs> Bro, that's disgusting. This is a beautiful little Mayan. Throw that guy right in there. What a, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, there's so many. So let's just see what we got, ready? What do we got? Oh my gosh. So we got a couple Mayan cichlids, we got a green tilapia, and we got a beautiful little, oh hi! A little jaguar cichlid, you ready? Ready, we're just gonna take this little guy. Hi guys, welcome to the Raw fam. What's up guys? Even though it is kind of a sad day, they're all gonna get eaten, but I think we're gonna keep a couple of the jags because they're pretty cool. So, you ready? All right, I just have to get them all out. You ready? We got some jags right there. Beautiful little jag. Ow! Just throw them in. Oh my, look at this little baby jag right there. See that little girl? Hi! What's up, bro, fam? So, we're just gonna take this little guy, throw him right there. Bro, I have to just, I'm just gonna go like this. Ready? Ugh. So what do we get? Okay, so we got this guy right here. We got all these little guys right there. Oh my goodness. Look, we got all these little minnows and mollies too. Just gonna keep throwing them in here. Make sure we get all the little minnows too. Everybody is good, everybody is safe. They're all inside of that little bucket. Now guys, I would call that, if I was out on a boat, blacking out the whale, cause that is pretty cool. So a lot of people ask me, yo, you go out, you make all these traps, but how do you keep all these fish alive? And it's simple, it's right here. This is called an aerator, and all you have to do is turn it on right there. You ready, look at this. This is so sick, it's gonna start bubbling. Oh, how cool is that? Ready, I'm just gonna put this inside of it. Ready? See all the little bubbles? Now that is an aerator that's providing oxygen into that water. So all those little babies will make it safe and sound over to my pond to get annihilated by my massive red tails. They're gonna go like this. This fish trap right here was a massive success, guys. This thing is totally cool. This thing is totally epic, guys. I mean, honestly, how freaking cool is this massive little plastic bin fish trap? I mean, honestly, Raw Fam, uh, I would probably rate it uh, an A plus plus plus. <laughs> we got an A on this assignment, definitely, if I was at school. But of course, Raw Fam, this is totally freaking epic. I love you, Raw Fam, but we gotta get all of these beautiful little baits because now we are the proud owners of all of these beautiful little cichlids, these jags, these beautiful little minnows, and uh, we gotta get them back to the Raw Fam. So let's get out of here. We're done with the fish trap for today. We don't really need it. We're gonna. We're gonna put that right there. All of the little baits are right here. They're ready to go. They're having oxygen, you know, the aerator on them. We're not gonna be feeding that many fish today. The only fish we're gonna be feeding is actually inside of this. So we're gonna have to take some of this plywood off and actually see if we could get in there and see how my red tails are doing. All right, Raw Fam, so I'm just gonna have to like lift this one up. Hi, babies. How you doing? Hey, I think they're kinda hungry, Raw Fam. So I'm just gonna come right here. It's feeding time. Hey, babies, how you guys doing? What's up, Raw fam? So I'm gonna get these guys in the mood to eat. Now, you ready? This is all you really have to do over here if you guys ever wanna feed my red tail. So you ready? Take your hand, put it right here, and tap the plastic line, you ready? Hey, babies. So now they're all kind of getting excited. They're moving around, but they're all gonna start facing towards me. They're all gonna start looking directly at me. See this guy? He's ready to eat. Oh. <laughs> they're also a little bit shy. I'm just gonna grab one of the smaller cichlids out of here, and we're just gonna see, yeah, yeah, perfect. Just like a perfect little cichlid. Now we're gonna go head first. Now I'd actually be kind of surprised if one came up and ate, but of course this is their favorite little treat. So you ready? Hi, Mr. Redtails. You guys hungry? We're just gonna go nice and slow. Come on. Come on. 